Welcome everybody to Skin Arc. In this series, we will be covering all the skins that is coming out on the West server in Lost Ark. And we will be also covering all the skin prices and how much they go for in the future as well. And before the video starts, I'll be giving away the new weapon skin we just got. And this mount, new mount skin that we just got to what, two of the lucky subscriber in the comment section so all you gotta do is like and subscribe the video and you get a chance to get picked to earn one of these prize right now we are only giving away these kind of giveaway to na west players in the future i'll be giving away for every single regions uh if this series goes well so make sure to like and subscribe to support the series and uh yeah let's get into it so we are going to look into sorcerer skin first and uh, this is the skin that we got the bikini skin it's pretty nice obviously you can dye them and dye to your favorite color you like um the hat some people might like it some people don't so for me i would probably not wear the hat and leave the long hair on my character instead it would be it would be a lot nicer and obviously the weapon is pretty cute a little elephant and some bubbles coming out and also windmill at the bottom which is pretty cool i guess some people will like it some people don't so it's personal reference stuff it's pretty cool and this is the second skin that we have um you get a glasses you get a this kind of reminds me of one piece character uh outfit it kind of does look like it has that kind of theme and obviously the weapon i will be showing you it the rest of the weapon skin that you you can get and this is what it looks like when you pull out your weapon it's kind of holding the weapon like backwards so that's kind of interesting i guess it's not looking at the front but okay like the elephant is not facing at the front so that's uh huh maybe they can change that i guess now let's look at the third skin that we got um personally i don't think this skin is that good i have seen a couple of people um gotten this skin i guess it's kind of um resembling uh the japanese swimming suit so maybe some people find this nice and uh yeah it's pretty okay obviously you can also dye this one to another color if you want to as well now let's look at the fourth skin that we have here now this skin i think it's probably the best out of all of them well that's my opinion some some people might think it's not that cool or sexy i guess and um yeah this is a pretty good skin you can all you can also dye the uh, chain thing around uh, the waist and everything as well to your favorite color and uh, yeah this is a pretty good bikini skin I would say and obviously we have high heels I, I think every female have high heels it's uh yeah <laughs> on the, even on assassin character they also have high heels as well so and this is the fifth skin um the original color is not that great I would say but some people will like it obviously and uh, you can always re-dye it to another color that fits your hair color or whatever and uh, yeah this is a pretty solid skin still pretty solid pretty good and this is gonna be another skin <clears throat> there's three there's two skins here that we have um, they are 28 dollars each youth skin set and lover skin set and we're gonna look into this this is the uh, this is the lo lover skin set um it's actually really really good i would say because the the um the underwear is just extremely good and you can redye that to different color too um uh, for the top some people might think it's not revealing enough so maybe that's a no-go but i i think it's still pretty cool it, you can always uh dye them to another color and the hat as well the hat is it's actually really good i really like this style there's some chain things going on and little oh wow okay yeah that's uh that's a really good hat probably the, one of the best hats in the game right now i think but <laughs> i'm not too sure about that and obviously the glasses uh, with some shades in it the shades uh, yeah that's also really good as well probably the best glasses right now in the game and uh this is a pretty good skin overall i would say i would probably rate this to like maybe 9 out of 10 yeah 9 out of 10 it's pretty darn good and there's another different variation obviously and uh this is another one which is a lot more brighter side white and it actually matched really well with my hair color too so that is amazing um 
And for people that likes white hats and stuff, uh, this is probably the best. Oh my god, it actually fits so well for, with my outfit. It's crazy. Wow. Um, yeah, this is a really good outfit. I might consider getting this in three days. I will be probably just buy with gold, with gold, and because of the three days uh, penalty, and I have to wait for three days so I can buy with other people with gold. So, wow, this is amazing. This is a, this is definitely a ten out of ten skin for me. And uh, yeah, and also there's another another color variation. Um, this one is pretty much the same. Just the d color differences. Actually, I don't know if you can dye these skins. I'm pretty sure you could. And yeah, there's this is another one. Also really good. It's straight up bikini. It doesn't have to cover on your shoulder for this one, which is pretty nice. I really like this one too. And it also includes the shades and the hat as well. And this is the other one variation. It's nice, probably 10 out of 10 for this one. And this is the just white um, variation. It's still really good. I like the hat. The hat color fits my hairstyle, so that's kind of cool, I guess. Yeah, this is a definitely really good one for sure. Now let's look at this youth skin set. And this is the first variation that you can get. Pretty sure they are also dyeable, so. If you do like this skin, you can dye it. You can buy it and dye it. Pretty cool. This is a close up look. It's got that little neck thing going on. I'm not too sure what you call that thing, but that's pretty cool. And you also got piercing on your eyebrow as well. I just noticed. Um, and also the earring is like a ring earring. Can you not move? Yeah, there's a piercing there. Yeah, for people that like piercing on their character, this is probably one of the characters you can go for. You can buy pieces of it off the auction house after three days of this skin release. Well, but yeah, this is a pretty cool skin, I would say. And this is the other variation, different color. And close up. And this is a... I don't know. I don't know why there's so many variation. Like you can just dye these skins anyway, but yeah, there you go. Oh, this is the other variation that doesn't have that cover on the waist, which is probably better. And you can also see the chain on the fire as well, which is kind of cool. I I guess I call them chain, but like there there must be some special name for it. But yeah, this is a probably a better skin in that variation so let's look at the other one oh this one is kind of it's kind of got that uh leopard sort of uh stripe on it okay not too bad pretty good and this variation some people probably think this is, looks good as well i think it looks pretty okay pretty nice but definitely not my type of uh, color that I would go for. Now let's have a look at the weapon. <laughs> the weapon skin, it, it looks actually pretty funny. Uh, for Berserker especially, like this is entire skewer. <laughs> so you're just smacking people with this skewer. There's prawn, there's a tomato, there's cheese, there's freaking everything on it. It's, it looks pretty funny. And the other one is, oh, this is probably one of my favorite as well. This is a hot dog gray sword. <laughs> it looks actually it looks hilarious. Imagine just smacking people with this thing. Oh my lord. Yeah, this is actually pretty funny. Some pretty funny skins around. And obviously we can't miss the corn. Oh my lord. <laughs> Alright, let me just pull it out and see how it goes. Oh my god, it's actually freaking massive. Oh, that's what she said. Um yeah, this is the entire corn that you can smack people with. It's pretty nice. Let me also show you how it look like, looks like when you pull them up. Oh my god, dude. That's a big schlong if you don't. <laughs> Crazy. And let's look at this one, obviously. Um, okay. Got some lemon as well. Hmm. Right, yeah. Pretty funny skin overall. I really like it. Probably a 10 out of 10 for me. <laughs> that's, that's just hilarious. And this is the Arcanus skin. It's actually the same skin that we have for um, Bart as well. It's exactly the same. It's got that 
um, what was that bird called? Anyway, you know what I mean. It's basically the skin, same as the bard skin. Alright, this is the martial artist weapon skin. It looks pretty cool actually. Um, it's got like a little wave thing going on. Sort of like a sea wave, I guess. It's pretty cool. And let's have a close up look for this skin. There you go. It's got pearl and star and starfish on it, I guess. Yeah, that's. Yeah, I would definitely get this skin if, if I was like a war dancer main. I would definitely get this. It looks pretty nice. And this is the second skin for the summer skin. It's just a big boxing glove, really. Nothing too special about it. There's a lobster on it and some star. And that's about it. And this one, this one looks a little bit funny to me. It's a dolphin on your hand around like a little, uh, what, what do you call that? The, the rescue ring thing, whatever. But yeah, this is the third variation for the weapon skin for War Dancer. And this is the weapon skin for Death Blade. It's like a fruity blade, I guess. It's like a frozen um, lemon or orange in there. And there's some, a lot of fruit stuff going on. It looks like a, almost look like a ice cream sort of uh, tower thing. Pretty, pretty okay looking weapon, I would say. And this is the second variation for the weapon. And this is the third one. It looks like a watermelon. Pretty nice. And uh, I don't know what's what's the one on the back. I'm not too sure what that is. But oh, yeah, I, I think this is a pretty good skin. I, I might actually get this. Hmm. This is the weapon skin for Glavier. It's actually so long oh my god let's have a look wow that is a uh, probably the longest weapon in the game right now that's crazy there's some coral on it some wave style going on it's over really really nice weapon skin for glavia for sure now let's look at the second variation oh my god it's just a bunch of fruits on a stick it's like a fruit skewer i guess Oh, all right. Now let's have a look. Oh wow, it's also really freaking long as well. This weapon, it's crazy. I will probably get the first skin that the first variation show. Oh maybe I will get this one instead. There's a swordfish at the top of your uh, weapon. Okay, that's a that's like a harpoon on a swordfish. Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. That's pretty cool. But it's not as the skin is not as long as the first variation. I right, look at this. This is super long. Oh wait, it might be longer than this. It was kind of off screen. Okay, but this is way cooler though. Way better skin in my opinion. And let's have a look at the Shadow Hunter skin. <laughs> it's just double swordfish. Alright, let's have a look. Oh my lord. <laughs> Um, some people will definitely find this skin pretty funny or cool. Uh, it's a pretty nice skin. Uh, I, I kind of like it. It's pretty cool. Let's look at the second variation. And this is the second variation. Um, it's blades with... A, it's sort of like a dessert blade, I guess. Oh, okay. Wow, it's actually pretty nice. Like the shape wise, like how it's designed with all those spikes around it. That's actually really nice. I really like this. And the front, uh, it's like a little blade, like a wave blade at the front. It's pretty nice, pretty okay. Now let's look at the third variation. This is the last one probably. And uh, whoa. Okay, it's got some wave, like actually curve on it. This is also a pretty good skin as well. I will probably rate this about uh, 8, 8 out of 10. Yeah, 8 out of 10 would be a pretty good number for this skin. Alright, let's look at the warrior class. Uh, we have paladin skins here. And this is the first skin variation we got. Uh, it's a little dolphin at the handle and with some windmill going on. <laughs> it's pretty funny. And uh, the little shorts and little sandals. Pretty good skin overall, I would say. Uh, the hat uh, kind of reminds me of Supreme hat. Like, look at this. There's the red thing with the logo on it. Lost Ark thing. I think it's uh, writing in Lost Ark. I'm not too sure. 
Let's look at the second variation. And this is the second variation. Um, this variation is pretty okay. Personally, I like topless uh, skins for Wario class because, you know, you can see how jack they are. It's just better. Um, so this skin is definitely not for me, but some people might like it. Who knows? Oh my god, what is this skin? <laughs> Uh, uh, I don't know, man. I guess some people will also like this skin. I guess I can't really judge because I'm not them. But for me, uh, I don't know about this skin. Honestly, I don't. I don't think it's that great. <laughs> and this is another skin for the warrior. It's pretty nice, I guess. It just shows your apps and everything you still look jack and there's a there's some um, physics going on as well at the bottom of the uh, shirt so when you walk around it does sway a little bit and uh yeah this is pretty pretty good skin i would say because I, I like i like when my clothing is swaying and sway and have some movement when i'm moving around so it's quite nice and this is the underwear only for male character I know a lot of people go crazy with this and you can dye this skin as well so you can dye it to whatever the color you like um this is one of the skin that uh, people would definitely use and use some funny weapon along with it so yeah the, uh, some people is definitely gonna like this skin for sure and this is the lover skin for warrior class pretty cool um i think the weapon is not in there i think i don't think the weapon is alongside with it Yep, it's just the clothing. Okay, like I said, I don't really like this kind of covering your top sort of skin. It just doesn't look that great to me. Um, and this is what the back looks like for anyone that really like this kind of skin. Kind of, kind of reminds me of John Cena for some reason. <laughs> and this is the second variation. Just different color. You can probably dye it to another color as well. So all these different variation is, yeah, it's just the same. Uh, reskin model really now let's look at the youth skin set all right now this is a better way way better skin wow it's actually really nice you got a little necklace going on you got a little i don't know that's lost arc batch sort of thing style going on you also have tattoo as well on the hand i don't know if that's like default i think it's from the skin and this there's also a little tattoo here with gold watch that this is actually a really nice skin wow i would definitely get this skin if i uh have money but but you know right now this is actually a really nice skin i would rate this 10 out of 10 for sure let's look at a different vari variation uh just different coloring and uh yeah it's all the same and this is uh the D destroyer weapon skin for the first variation it's pretty cool pretty nice and this is the second one it's it's a whole the new mount thing on your weapon it's actually pretty cute but uh yeah now let's pull it out oh my god that's the entire thing all right yep yeah this is uh oh wow <laughs> now this is the third skin it's a rubber ducky on your weapon for destroyer this is actually nice i i would definitely get this for my destroyer as it looks pretty funny and yep there you go and this is the scrapper weapon skin it's just a bunch of flower ro wrapping around your hand it's a pretty okay skin it, it doesn't look like they put a lot of effort to design this skin but there you go there's a lot of chain thing around your weight uh, your arm as well which is okay i guess it's just flowery looking and this is the second variation um, there's a swan on your uh, elbow and a lot of rings around it. Let's have a close-up look. It kind of look like a life got a life-saving thing, whatever. Ugh, what do you call that? But yeah, this is anyway. This is uh, what it looks like for the scrapper. And now the third variation. Now this is actually really nice wow um there's some fishes i think i'm not too sure what that is there's some bubble around it some wave st stuff going on it's very sea like sort of theme uh weapon skin i guess 
This is actually pretty nice. I really like this. Let's look at this from afar. And that's what it looks like. Overall, this is probably the best scrapper skin out of those three. Uh, in my opinion. But that is just my opinion. Right, for the Sophis. And this is the first variation of the weapon. It's uh, Octopus. With some water water thing going on down there. Floating. Pretty nice. It's the same. Um, okay, I don't need, really need to show you that. Okay. There's some starfish on top of it, and there's a little fish there. Pretty cute. Now let's look at the second variation. This is a seahorse. It's pretty nice. It's floating. <laughs> I remember there's a really good one. I think it's the dirt one. No, it's not. Uh, this is a little swan one for the third variation. Ah, uh, there you go. This is the one that I'm talking about. This is rubber ducky with uh some with the rainbow on top of it. Ah, oh, that is so cute. I saw somebody had this just now. It's actually, oh uh, wow. It's probably one of the best uh sofa skin out there for sure. It's so cute. It's super nice. Now let's look at the dead eye skin. Um, if you look at this weapon, uh, this is oh this is the rifle skin. It's a yellow dolphin. This is the... Wait. Oh, never mind. This is a shotgun skin for the Deadeye. And then this one. Oh my lord. This is a rifle skin for Deadeye. That's pretty freaking amazing. I actually pretty... It's pretty cool. Okay. Now let's look at the pistol. It's a pistol skin. This is a smaller version of this. So it's, it's also pretty cool, I guess. Now let's look at the second variation. Oh, now this one is just, uh, they just kind of recolor it. It didn't really change much. And this is a shotgun version of it. And this is the uh, rifle version of it. Yeah, they didn't really change much. Now this one is the third variation, probably the last one. It's got two fish aside, alongside with it. And then the shotgun. And the rifle. Oh, okay. Wow. It's got like a little wave blade thing going on. Okay. And I think this is the weapon skin. Comes along with this set. The package itself. And let's have a look what it looks like. Oh. Okay, that's actually a really clean skin. It's like a water gun sort of skin. And it's got a little bubble uh, animation going on too. And now let's have a look at the rifle skin. This rifle skin is super clean. I would definitely recommend getting this skin. Wow, that if I was a dead dead eye player, I would definitely get this skin. It looks super clean. Um, the weapon, the the weapons, they are all super clean. I really like all these weapons. They look super nice, especially this rifle. Oh my god, that's that's just really nice. It just looks super nice. But with the glow, I'm not too sure if you can still see the weapon. You can probably just disable the glow to, you know, see the skin yourself. Let me see if there's any, any other variation. Alright, uh, yeah, there's a different color variation uh, for it. The shotgun. Oh, the bubble color is also changed as well, which is pretty cool. And the rifle. The rifle also have a little bubble animation going on here as well. Pretty nice. And yeah, there is about three colors uh, variation for this uh, Dead Eyes weapon skin. Now let's have a look at the skin that you can get from the package itself. So th there's three variation for it, and this is the Sharpshooter's weapon skin, obviously. And this is what it looks like when you put it out. I love all these skins that have some sort of animation going on. It just makes the skin looks way better. Um, and this is the first one. It looks pretty cute. It's got a rubber ducky with uh, two pedals and the wave going on. And that's just really cute. And this is the second variation. It just recolor. Not much differences. Oh, it looks like a penguin instead now. Okay, it's a penguin. Alright, that's uh, cool. Pretty cool. And this is the third one. Uh, this is probably a better version of the penguin, I guess. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, this is pretty cool as well. Now let's have a look at this weapon skin. This <laughs> this is the other weapon skin. It, there is more flowery like and starish. And let's look at the second variation. Oh, it's just flowery skin. <laughs> Some people might like it. And let's look at the third variation. Ooh, this is a pretty nice one. It's got some. It's got a lot of stars and wave stuff going on. 
pretty nice. As far as I can see, every class have about 6 different skins except Paladin. I don't know why Paladin doesn't have their weapon skin and they only have the 3 variation one from the package itself which is kind of weird. And now let's have a look at the Striker weapon skin. Just 2 Ula's ring thing on your hand I guess. It's pretty okay. Uh, it will probably match up with a lot of the skin that you want to match up with. Um, it's a pretty okay skin I would say. This is what it looks like on battle mode. <laughs> it just looks like donut to me. <laughs> and now let's look at the second variation. It's the same. Different color. You can probably dye to a different color as well. So uh, this is this is literally a donut. Okay. Nice. And obviously there's no weapon. There's no swimsuit weapon skin for it. Don't know why. But yeah, it, if it's showing Berserker, that means it doesn't have the skin for it. So there you go. Anyways, that is pretty much it. I'm pretty sure I covered up every single skin. I probably missed a little bit of the skins here and there. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe. I will see you in the next skin arc series. Peace.